Hi everybody and welcome to the Shulu Club. Yes, we are at X Idol, X Hero Idol Adventure again this morning. Uh, yes, I should call it maybe just X Hero. Uh, <laughs> and the the question I want to address is 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 kind of an obvious one, but not so obvious now that I know better the game. Are S heroes better than S plus heroes? Well, that question doesn't make any sense. I mean, of course, S plus heroes like her over here. <laughs> She's gonna be better That's than any other S, like Medusa, for example. So why would I ask something like that? Uh, so th the the thought process that's behind that is that I saw this on Discord, on our Discord. Uh, someone was saying that his best team right now was uh, mostly composed of S heroes, and I didn't understand what he was saying because that didn't make any sense for me. I mean, of course, if you have S plus, it's gonna be better than an S. What I didn't know at that point, or didn't realize at that point, is that, of course, uh, there's two ways to, to level up your heroes. Um, there is the, uh, the level, which is kind of obvious, uh, but there's also the rarity of it. And when you start, most of your heroes will probably be blue, with the, 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 the surrounding, the, the corner uh, is going to be blue, and you can upgrade them to blue, I'm going to call that blue plus, uh, with the purple uh, on the right corner and uh, the left bottom corner and then you can upgrade them to purple uh, some of them you get get purple right away from purple you can get to purple plus uh, I don't have one here uh, but you can get them to purple plus and then you can get to gold and those upgrades give so much more power to your characters and from there you can get to gold plus you can get to red to red plus and finally, the end stage, which I didn't reach. I have one S character so far. Well, it's Van Helsing, this? who is a well, red. Is so and why do S characters are easier to get them? Let me show you rapidly here. It's because the way the Lab of Awakening is working. So if I want to upgrade, for example, this dude over here with an S, and I need to get him to gold, then... My problem is that I need a double of him. And it's the same thing as uh, if you want to go for, from, um, no, let's take him out. If you want to go from, for example, I think I have one over here. Um, my red one over here to get to red plus, I just need another red. But if I want to get to something plus, to the next level, I need a copy. Uh, let me show you here. Um, would she be a good example? Yes. To get her for purple to uh, to um, gold, you need another copy of her. Or if you want to get it, I didn't show you what I wanted to show you. I'm sorry. Um, I'm searching here. For example, uh, my friend over here, Einstein. If I want to get him for gold plus to red, I need another copy of him. So that is where the thing lies. It's in getting a copy of the character. And of course, S character are gonna be much more abound abundant. You're gonna get them more in your pool when you open up summon them than S plus. So yes, ultimately, if you can have a lot of the same character in S plus, it will become better and better and better. And at the maximum level, at the maximum, um, Awakening, if I can say so, it will be better than an S. But you have to get those in many examples, and that is pretty rare. I was extremely lucky uh, to get at least one. I have I have one of those, and I was so lucky. Um, let me show it to to you. Uh, she's over here. Uh, it's a uh, um, e uh, electric arc, uh, Indira. Uh, I was able to get a copy of her, so I was able to get her to gold. Uh, now I was able to get her to gold plus, but now I need another copy of her to get her to red. So this is much more difficult to do with S plus than S. So I think I made my point here. Um, awakening characters, it's much more easy with S than S plus. Also, sometimes with synergy, you want to have some teams that will complete each other. Sometimes an S that is really... Uh, eye level or really uh, awake a few times will be able to go further uh, down the road and help you more. 
So, yeah. So if I want to resume, what I'm saying is that basically, if you have the same rarity, the same level of awakening, an S plus is going to be better but than an S. But ultimately, when you play the game, it will be much more easy to awaken more times your S than your S plus. So while you're getting there, the S might be better than your S plus for some times until you get doubles of them. I hope this is helpful uh, for those of you who are not um, really, uh, I mean, uh, who are just starting the game or in kind of the middle of the game. Right now, you see I'm at level 71. I think I really kind of understood that from level 50 or something, that that distinction is really important, the awakening versus the levels um, and, uh, and the equipment and everything. So there's a lot to consider here, but I wanted to clarify that because for me, it was such a mystery at the beginning, why would someone say that an S could be better than an S plus? That didn't make any sense. So I hope with this explanation, it will be uh, clearer for you guys. So thank you for listening. I hope that was useful to you and I'll see you soon. If you have anything else that you want to see me do, if you want explanation, if you have questions, please, I don't know everything in the game. I consider myself st still being not a noob, but a noob plus, let's say, a gold noob uh, if I go with Awakening. Uh, but yeah, I can I can still probably help some of the new player or some of the, be the beginner's players that are out there. So leave me a question, leave me a comment down below, and I'll try to answer it as fast as I can. Thank you, everybody. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.